here I'm going to show you how to divide using standard form um, fairly similar to multiplication involving standard form you deal with the number part first and then the powers secondly so first of all we're going to do 3 divided by 2 and secondly we're going to do 10 to the 4 divided by 10 to the 5 3 divided by 2 1.5 and 10 to the 4 divided by 10 to the 5. When you divide in index numbers, you subtract the powers. So 5 take away 4 is negative 1. And there's still a multiply sign in the middle because that's the format standard form numbers take. A number less than 10 multiplied by a power of 10. So let's look at the similar method here. I'm going to do 6 divided by 5. And that's going to be multiplied by 10 to the 7 divided by 10 to the negative 3. Now this fairly straightforward calculation quite often catches people out because this will be on the higher paper. You should know 1 fifth is 0 0.2. Um, so 6 fifths, which this is, 6 divided by 5 would be 1.2. The other way you could do it is you could divide by 10. 6 divided by 10 is 0 0.6 and then double it to correct for that. So 6 divided by 5 is 1.2. 10 to the 7 divided by 10 to the negative 3. You subtract the powers, subtracting a negative number makes it bigger. So 7 take away negative 3 is the same as doing 7 plus 3 which would be 10. So the answer there is 1.2 times 10 to the 10 and no need to adjust the original number because it's still less than 10. So same method here 5.2 divided by 2 and that's going to be multiplied by 10 to the negative 5 divided by 10 to the negative 4. So slightly trickier because there's two negatives 5.2 divided by 2 is fairly straightforward, that's 2.6. Negative 5 divided by negative 4, so you subtract the powers. Negative 5 take away a negative 4 is the same as adding it on. So negative 5 add 4 gets you to 10 to the negative 1.